everyone, I'm Honeywell, and welcome back to part three. I just went ahead and looked at the previous recording, and the video issues seem to be resolved. Well, I mean, the quality is, uh, is more like a antenna TV than cable, but it's good enough, I think. And day three, that's charging up. Good. We are waiting for... You have got to be kidding me. <laughs> oh, Daria, where is Daria? Daria, get out there. This game is trying to kill us. Well, it is a challenge. <laughs> Daria, what are you... Oh, she has to get a spare. Oh, that's bad. There's our, uh... Spare timer is... <laughs> End a broken bone. This is, a. Uh... Yeah. Um... Quit with the bioplastic. you let the bot do that? Okay. This looks pretty bad. <laughs> okay, so we're down to one worker. But Slade Lane is still going to be uh, clogging up the place, eating our food. And, uh, being a nuisance. Poor guy. Maybe... And he can't even watch TV because there's no TV. <laughs> okay, at least we found out that as soon as they start working on it, they'll start working again. So, we're getting power, and as bad as that is, because it is bad, because we just kind of wasted a spare, um... It's not that bad. One resource and one res so we need two more metal. And we have two metal. So So we don't have to risk her. So we don't have to risk Maria in the mine until we have her landing pad up. So this isn't uh this is not not too bad. It's a. Uh, it's certainly challenging, though. I'm really glad I decided to to do this challenge because by the time I had reached this planet, before I was uh, pretty much done with the game, uh, but I'm enjoying this. It's uh, exciting times. I wish she would stop taking that out there, though. Oh, well, I guess he died. That's right, Daria. Fix the robot. And that's a nice little touch with the uh, little echo skeleton that they put on when they carry the, the heavy objects. So, it's, it's very nice. And Fernando... Well... I was going to say, if you have time to idle, he's tired. And what time is it? Oh, we still have plenty of time to get that fully charged up. And the mine isn't going to be on at all tonight, so it's actually not that bad. Wouldn't this be a handy bug if this works even without the connection being built? No, it just consumes power and I can't turn it off. It's not working out in our favor. It's working out against us. I can't turn this off. 
Daria, you ruined everything. So this is sucking up five power. And I can't turn it off like I could the mine because it's not finished. Maria, hurry up. 54%. There's not really, I don't have any metal that I can recycle without. <laughs> okay, well let's start a, let's turn off the cafeteria. She's going to bed, so let's uh, turn off the processing plant. And we can watch that. Oh, actually, I wonder if they... There's no point in having the trader come because there is absolutely nothing we can do. And... I don't want a medic right now. Because I don't have a, a sick bay. So there's no point in that. I would like another biologist and I would like a backup engineer, but I'm not even going to get that. So I'm going to leave this on 50% uh, workers, 30% biologists. Actually that's, that's crazy. What if I get a biologist and not a worker? I'm going to do 100% workers because I need the metal. Okay. Oh. You're going to eat on the floor. <laughs> okay, let's enable that. And enable this. So, so when uh, Maria gets up, she has something to do. Well, that's, uh, I guess they'll just go right in the meal maker, grab a meal and eat on the floor. And you were none too happy about that. Oh well. These are hard times. Are you going to get up? There you go. Go finish this metal so I can uh, control that landing pad. Please? Now, if I had a a sick bay or a med bay, um, he could lay in the lay in the bed, and he wouldn't eat or take up any resources or anything like that. I think their uh, needs are kind of put in stasis when they're in the med bay. So even if you don't have medical supplies, which we do, or a medic, which we don't, um, med bays are pretty uh pretty valuable. There's also a chance. Um, that they'll recover from radiation as well even without being treated so uh, we, we definitely want a med bay as soon as possible okay and that is uh, it's metal number 6 so yeah and that's the metal for the connection so you can go back in the mine this we can turn off and we're gonna make it through the night just fine and and here's a decision we need to fix our power situation but a med bay would be good to have as well. Nope. Power it's going to be. He's just going to have to uh, to deal. Okay, the very next thing that we need is is power. Now this solar panel will only produce a tiny bit more energy 
than what can be hold, held in this capacitor here. But that little extra bit of energy is going to help us while we're while we're waiting and before before we can build a factory which uh, consumes a lot of power and we need the factory in order to produce spares um, we're gonna need to be to have power to run it and this solar panel with uh, 24 kilowatts of uh, energy is uh, is just not enough. I mean, if need be, we could probably get by. I mean, with everything off, but the food in the factory. But uh, I mean, who wants to do that? It's getting on my nerves already. So that extra little bit of. Uh, extra little bit of energy that can be stored in that battery will help us <laughs> will help us keep things uh, up and running so we can get the metal produced and we can get the plastic produced instead of me turning off every other building you'll have a TV one day Daria so it feels uh, it feels like an absolute ton of metal to uh, be spending five metal on the largest uh, power collector. But I cannot tell you how many let's plays I've watched uh, where people um, spend they dot their whole landscape with these little power collectors and these little uh, solar or wind turbines and they never get themselves out of trouble you always always build the largest you absolutely can because if you don't you just you don't resolve the your power problems so we are building a large power collector and then we will be building a large solar panel to get us power stable enough to be able to run a processing plant and a mine and a factory not to mention a lab and a mid bay and everything else even these plants even these plants take a half a kilowatt of energy so every time I plant something that you're just you, the energy needs are just nonstop. And good job not breaking any bones. But we do have an ore, so we're going to turn this on, turn that off, and keep her safe in here. I want everything, uh, everything possible processed. And our status is good. So hopefully a, a colony ship will be arriving soon. Let's go a little bit faster. There we go. How many workers? Please send three. Three workers. Two. Two. That's good. Both of you, get in the mine. Don't even go inside. That's right. Good job, Laurel. And LL? <laughs> LL, get outside. There's nothing in for you, in here for you. Carry robot can do that. And actually we need to we need to get a bioplastic as well. 
because we don't have any storage. I don't want this starch to to decay. And with that in mind, we'll build some bunks that way as it's produced, it's used right away. And I can recycle any any of these interior structure structures without losing anything as soon as uh as soon as I need it. So I am absolutely fine with that. Good job. Look at that bioplastic worker. I guess I don't need to turn off the the dorm in the during the day because this fills up long before the day ends. So there's no point in of having anything off during the day, I don't think. Not until we get that power collector built. Good luck, Maria. Don't break a leg. <laughs> And, uh, who did I have this set for? We need to change this. I need a biologist. <laughs> I need an engineer. And I would like... I would like a medic. I do not want any guards. <laughs> I would be really upset if I, uh missed that in the guard game. Yeah. Um. Oh, are you not going to get that because I turned that off? Hurry up. Oh, I'm sorry. That was me messing with the uh, controls. And where... Where is our engineer? That's the biologist. Oh, there you are. Good job, Daria. I uh, put in a re requisition for uh, some help for you. Hopefully, they'll be along shortly. And it's night-night time, so the mine can go off. Slade, we're working on the plastic. Hopefully you can uh, sit and watch some TV soon. Maybe have a bunk to yourself. There will be no sick bay though. And this uses an extra kilowatt of power. <laughs> so anything that you do is. As soon as you get a little bit ahead and you add anything to the game, it the game just gets harder because you're increasing your power consumption. Okay, I'm going to go uh, four times speed because... because why? I'm not ignoring that power low message because I don't want the... I don't want the biodome to stop processing. And this is why power is important, because if I wasn't worried about food, I could let them keep working on 
Yes, I know it's critical. We're working on it. I could let them keep working. Let's turn that on. 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 Okay, everybody, get back to work, and we'll turn that on as well. Is anyone sleeping? No. I'm going to turn that off, though. Oh, wait. Didn't we decide there's no reason to do that as long as this fills up to 7,500? Okay. Oops. Whoops. A medic and a biologist. Okay. That's the least of what I wanted, but that is okay. Okay, I need zero of those. You know what? I'm gonna risk it with the... Did I, did I tell you how much I hate this whack-a-mole picking choosing system? Uh, I hate it a lot. We need workers now. Um, this tree, we're going to recycle it. And we'll get another wheat plant in there. Because we're going to need the starch. And we definitely need the food. Because I keep letting in all these colonists, and we're up to eight now, with only this teeny tiny bit of, oh. Oh, I guess that's the bad part here. I want that built before anything else. We keep letting in uh, colonists with only this teeny tiny amount of food, which is, uh, We're doing okay. But we can't keep going like that indefinitely. Okay, and there's our first produced plastic, which will go to our food. And I think, I don't know how long I've been uh, playing, but I think this is probably a good spot to... Uh, end the episode. We are increasing our colonists. Our next priority is to get five metal for our power collector. And we will do that in episode four. Okay, thanks again for watching, and I will see you next time.